Oh man. So guys, thoughts, thoughts. Uh, that's a good. That was still a good movie, even after God knows how long it was. <laughs> Oh no, I enjoyed every bit of it. Like I <laughs> just uh the chemistry. Again, I love the silent storytelling. Uh mm. that's I think that's a bit of a lost art in um modern storytelling. Mm-hmm. Uh, where like you could ex- like get have a character or protagonist that doesn't really use a lot of a lot of uh dialogue and expresses his uh feelings through, you know, facial expression, body expression and you can get exactly what he's thinking. Um, the chemistry between me and Eve. Obviously, most my favorite, as you saw. I thought everything was really fun. Um, the pace was slow, but I liked it. I loved the slow pacing for this. Because uh, everything built up very well. And I really thought Wally was going to die. Or at the very, if they would have went, like, if they really wanted to go dark, have him not remember. Oh. <laughs> oh. I would I would have been so pissed as a kid. But honestly, I, it would have said, hey, consequences, <laughs> you know. I don't know. What about you, Zam Zam? I mean, if this struck me as a kid, if I had, if he had not remembered, I would have just bawled. It would I would have flat out <laughs> cried. It's Mufasa's death all over again. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, except they actually got revenge for Mufasa's death. Yeah, I mean, but like Wally did do uh, his purpose, and Wally again, I, I I like this film. If they made a sequel, I wouldn't be mad at it. But honestly, this film's perfect as is. Um, it's one of those, yeah, again, it's, it's one of those rare, like, you know, it don't need a sequel, but I wouldn't mind if it did. Kinda I would just be curious where they would go for a sequel. As I well, just want to see I mean? what even Wally's relationship would be. You know, there's another, there's another droid that comes around that tries to seduce Wally. God damn it, stop. you getting jealous? Like, it's like this, like, she, like, it's like this black metallic kind of droid that, that, like, she has like a wild side that Wally's like interested in and I don't know. Why are you... <laughs> It's been over a decade. Like, stop Wally. it. What's well, the opposite of Eve? He has a buddy named Steve. <laughs> God damn it. Like, yeah, two new characters. Steve and uh, mm, Pandora. Yeah, Pandora. You know, because releases all the e- women, releases all the evil in the world. So Pandora. Will Wally open Pandora's box and fix God it? God damn it. Will stop. Mo learn to... Now, uh, the question, in this movie, I would have Mo struggle... Because he's on a planet that's nothing but decontaminated. So I feel like Mo would have a hard time adjusting to all like that the dirt. That is true. I feel like he, he just goes crazy with just all this. He has to learn to accept the filth, you know? And it's going to be such a hard struggle for him. Twinkie is eating chocolate now. <laughs> I don't know, just, just little stuff like that. Again, I, I feel like this film is, it, it, again, it's, it's, an, it's, a, it's another great film by uh, Pixar. Um Lots of up there up and stuff and other classic Disney. I, I honestly, we, we picked a bad time to watch Shrek because we could have went to the Shrek trilogy too at some point. We, we might, we might bring it back, guys. Um, I really also liked uh, how they were kind of using the human secondary to everything, but they were still incorporated throughout the film, which was really nice, almost like background pieces to the. Uh, like they were important, but they were like like background set pieces that ultimately added up. Um, I would say uh, with this film, it's one of those films that yeah, I could just I could watch quite a few times. Uh, not quite as pretty as uh, it has a gritty feel. Not as pretty as Finding Nemo, but it's like it didn't need to be. I like the whole. Dusk Wasteland, like if they made like a prequel, I'd be interested in watching. Wally's awesome. And yes, you need to show me that picture where he puts R2 Dietrich's picture away from seeing Eve. Eve was great. Oh my God. I can see, I honestly, if I was a robot, I'd go with Eve. I, she had a nice voice. <laughs> so, <laughs> sometimes the voice is all it takes. You can't tell Talk me that. smashing characters now? <laughs> I'm just saying, if I was a robot, I'm just saying, how you doing? How you doing, Eve? Maybe you mean you could do some things. My name is Wolfie. Wolfie. Oh. Mo. Mo money? Mo money? Mo. Mo. Mo was awesome throughout this film. Uh, yeah, I, yeah, I got nothing more. Any other final thoughts, guys? 
after almost a decade of this movie being out, it still holds up. Indeed. Just it's like, holy shit. I'll say it was a great movie through and through, give, given how uh, uh, how long it's been, like, we see it. I know I saw a while back in February was them here, but it was so good up to this very day. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, guys, that is Wally. Well, um, if you guys have any suggestions on what movie we, we on what movie you would like to us to watch next, leave a suggestion in the comic section. Maybe we'll do a poll um, if we get enough suggestions. It doesn't have to be Pixar; it can be whatever movie you want. You know, whatever. We'll watch porn. <laughs> yeah, we'll watch porn. We'll watch hentai. Sure. <laughs> oh God, you think we should do that? Like what? <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm, not, I'm all for it. Like, if they suggest we watch hentai, let's watch some hentai. Hey, yo, this hentai pretty Let's watch Bible Black. <laughs> no. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, chicks with dicks. There are no chicks with dicks, only guys with... With tits. <laughs> hey, oh, my God, we're good. All right, we need to stop. All right, we're going we're gonna to cut this, guys. We'll see you next time. See you for the next movie reaction. Stay tuned. And, uh, yeah, say goodbye, guys. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. God, hentai. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>